Now McNeely in behind the net. Playing up the right wing boards for Jeff Irwin. To the right point to Peter Murth. Right wing circle to Jeff Irwin. Into the slot for Kyle Torres. Shot, scores! Kyle Torres on the power play gives the Express a 1-0 lead. Wagar feeding it down low for Nearing, who takes him behind the end of the wraparound. Loose in front, and it comes to Kyle Torres as Maddock returns the play and gets the puck at center. Over the line, the left wing as Torres goes towards the middle. Maddock in front for Torres, back in, scores! Second of the game for Kyle Torres, and it's a 2-0 Express lead. What a play by Torres, spotting Maddock coming out of the penalty box, hitting him with a pass, and then continuing on and skating down through the middle, received the pass with a defender on his back, made a move to his left, and a backhand into the back of the net behind Bothwell to give the Express a 2-0 lead at six minutes, 57 seconds into the first period. Sixth goal of the Royal Bank Cup, Jovan Matic will get the assist at 6.57. Mirth, back for the puck for the Express, plays up the right wing for Brady Cook in his own zone. Cook, alludes to check and gets it out to center for Sandarelli. It's two on one with Cunningham. Sandarelli shoots, save, rebound, Cunningham scores! Stephen Cunningham got the rebound and it's a three nothing Express lead! Nice play by Stephen Cunningham, picking the uh, rebound out of the air and batting it in behind Bothwell to give the Express a three to nothing lead off the two on one. Look out here, here comes Turris looking for the hat trick. Kyle Turris, stop made. Turris again, soars, scores! Just unbelievable uh, puck pressure here by uh, Turris. He just uh, goes in there, there's three uh, Yorkton guys in the corner. He's just patient, he gets the puck. They turn it over, soars, goes to the net, and uh, it's a great goal. Bad turnover there. He just goes in here, almost scores there. Follows the puck though. Keeps coming, keeps coming. Finds it. Three guys collide into each other. Slides across the source. Source goes top shelf, and uh, it's four nothing now for the Burnaby Express. And watching them play today, I can tell, I can see why they call them the Express. Try to find some way to beat the Burnaby netminder. In front, Korczynski with the best chance the Terriers had all night. The Terriers, most valuable player this year. And Saskatchewan late top scorer. Oh. Soars. Turris scores! There's the hat trick. Just, just another great goal, but I mean, Soares makes a great little pass there. Good players can make good plays in small spaces, and that's what happened there. And, uh, you know, when you, when you can score a goal like that on the top shot of the goalie's glove, it's unbelievable. Great play by Soares there, and uh, he just goes top shelf, great release, but uh, great play by Mark Soares here. He just uh, takes a puck, little tight spot, and Torres makes no mistake. Just a great goal, and he's uh, just been unbelievable in the two games that we've seen here. Well, they do love Kyle Torres in Burnaby right now. The Express expressing themselves in a big way. Five nothing, Turris with a hat trick. Seven goals now in the tournament. Soares, Maddox and Turris have been the big line. Santarelli now two on one and he scores! The floodgates wide open here, six nothing. Just another example of a two, two on one and uh, I think the goalie thought he might be passing it across and uh, he took the shot. Little chip there, uh, bad read again by the D and it's a two on one. Uh, looks off the uh, defenseman like he's gonna pass and uh, makes no mistakes and uh, puts it in the net. Smart play here, great shot, goal. And a goaltending change now. Lyndon Sammartino coming in and Brett Bothwell had a good tournament, will go out of the game. Straight nose to Menke. Nearing knocks it down, puck still in, and Yorkton has found the net finally on a bouncing puck. They need more of that. Hey, you know, it's good for the Yorkton team there to keep going, and uh, the defenseman there, number 22, Dustin Nearing, uh, just put the puck to the net. Korczynski getting it back to Holmes. One-timer from the point. Korczynski in front, and the Terriers have scored. 
And maybe this will put some life back in Yorkton. 6-2 now. With the Express win the draw. The Chameleon fighting for the puck behind the net. Crowder scores. Just like that, it's 7-2. I think what happens there is you got three guys going behind the net rod, and uh, the reason Crowder is where he is is not because he's trying to be an offensive player, but he's staying high, so they give up no odd man rushes, and uh, he's a little higher in the slot than you normally are, and as a result, nobody picks him up, and uh, he gets a pretty easy goal. But, you know, he's there for defensive purposes, but uh, the puck comes out to him, and he makes no mistake on the six, stick side, and I believe that's the first goal uh, of the game for the uh, top line of Burnaby. To Seabrook. Snapping a shot from the line, that's blocked and it goes to the right wing boards. Where it comes on the right wing for McNeely who fits, feeds Seabrook at the right point. Left point to Samoes, back to Seabrook, wide, shoot, scores! It's a power play goal for Keith Seabrook. It's a 8-2 express lead. Face off to the left of Bryce Luker, 37.4 seconds to go here in the third period. Now the Burnaby fans who are here in attendance today start to come to their feet. The express bench is starting to get into celebration mode now as Orban controls the puck, plays up the right wing in his own zone for Mark Soares, who flips on the left wing for Jeff Irwin, who skates at the center. Into the middle for Crowder over the Terry line, trying to feed it back. That's broken up with 25 seconds to go. Here's Soares, dropping it to his own line for some O's. He'll just skate at the center and play it on the right wing for Soares over the Terry line, moving in on the left side. That's broken up as now Soares gets to the net. He shoots and the save. Rebound put through the crease with only 10 seconds to go. The Burnaby Express of 2005 and 2006 have done it. They are the 2006 Royal Bank Cup champions. Who would have believed it? with the start that the Express had at the beginning of this season. All the fellas coming onto the ice. The Royal Bank Cup is coming to Burnaby. The Burnaby Express are the best in Canadian Junior A hockey.